and chicken. Oh my god. Damn. Well, I ran out of Goya, which is pretty fucked up because I need it, but whatever. Somebody said Caribbean soak their meat, and that's good for them. I'm not Caribbean. Like, I'm not about to have this fucking argument with you guys on this goddamn thing today. I'm going to just end the fucking live because y'all little ass kids be irritating me all the fucking time. Oh, let me put garlic in there. I'm only using this minced garlic because I'm lazy. And I don't feel like chopping garlic. I literally hate chopping garlic. It's just so small and annoying. So when you marinate your meat... You really only have to marinate it for like 30 minutes. Like that'll get it in there. But whatever. Drop that hole. Okay, also. For this recipe, I usually use a green pepper. And yes, these are clean. So let me say your white side is showing for real. Bitch, y'all motherfuckers can't cook. I can cook for Fuck y'all. Fuck my white side is showing. And my mom is white. My mom can cook. So bitch, suck my dick. Anyways. So I'm cutting the onion. I'm literally only on here because... I don't know. Are y'all really still on here talking about some... The fucking meat? Like, are y'all so serious right now? Somebody said turn off the comments. No, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> the fuck? Y'all are fucking losers. Somebody said, yeah, you learned that from your mom. Bitch, you look like a fucking roach in that goddamn Abby. And I didn't learn how to cook from my mom. My mom never cooked for me as a child. I grew up like fucking Matilda, really. So, shut the fuck up. about you learn that from your mom and y'all bitches ain't learned shit from your fucking parents raggedy ass bitches <laughs> bitches don't even know how to do their own fucking hair wash their own ass <laughs> said this bitch that matilda i swear to god i was literally a latchkey kid like my mom started leaving me at home like when I was like seven, eight years old. But she had to, beach, and I was with my grandma. My grandma wasn't doing shit. Anyways, so I'm fucking dicing up these goddamn onions for these beans. I'm doing half of an onion. And I like a lot of onions. I, I could really do this whole shit. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> Bitch, they on my fucking dick right now. Bitches can't even fucking cook without opinions. Like, sit this one out, bitch. All you guys fucking eat is ramen noodles. The fuck trying to tell a bitch how to prepare something. Bitch, go prepare that fucking lace front. That's fucked up. Oh my god, I'm hella mad. My fucking big pot. I'm heck mad. I don't want to use this little ass pot. Whatever. I'm only cooking for me. Actually, oh, fuck. I need a bigger cutting board. I'm gonna put it on a plate.
Okay, I really, I'm hecka mad this is not a green pepper. But, yeah, no, I'm actually pretty mad now that I'm thinking about it more. Oh shit, my eyes are starting to burn. Somebody said, why are people on here to hate? Because they're fucking poor and miserable. We know this. All poor people do is hate. Rich bitches don't hate. Poor bitches do. That's a poor bitch trait. Literally. I ain't never in my life commented on nobody's picture, said nothing negative in their life, hated at all in that type of way, bitch. Like, that shit is so disgustingly poor it's just like you have nothing better to do i'm a heck of a i'm using these red ass peppers but these all good as fuck i used to eat these all the time when i was little a true delicacy. I really don't want to put too much of this red ass pepper in there though, bitch. I'm actually really annoyed. Why didn't I get a green pepper? Am I dumb? Must be. I'm really not going to put that much because I just feel like this is going to be too sweet. But I do have this can of like these green chilies. But... take the filter off no i love this filter it makes me look cute y'all this fucking guy bro i got this guy's number on some friendship and i'm gonna just tell you like this there is no fucking reason if you are not my goddamn man even if you are my motherfucking man do not blow my fucking phone up. When I tell y'all I hate, hate getting my freaking phone blown up. Do not double text me. Like, and then I'm I'm the bad person when I answer and be like, bitch, why the fuck are you blowing up my phone? Like, I literally just have to block this man. I'm like, bro, like, I don't even fucking know you like that. That's why I do not give my number out. I literally do not give my number out. People always think I'm acting funny. I'm being bougie. No, y'all motherfuckers do not know how to fucking have somebody's number and chill. Like the fuck? That shit is so irritating. This motherfucker literally had the audacity to call me. Two times back to back after triple texting me yesterday. Like, are you fucking dumb? All right, so I'm putting these, I'm about to put these beans back here. You take a little bit of oil. Bloop. Okay. Like that, like that, like so. What the hell? Okay. Then I'm going to take a plastic bag and put this dang pepper in it because I'm going to use it tomorrow for spaghetti. I do not like that shit. The quickest way to turn me off is to be on my dick too hard too soon. The only time I like a nigga to be on my dick is when I'm already in love with him. Period. Bitch, if I ain't said I love you, really, I'll call you. Or you could just call me a check on me at once a day. Send one text. Like all that fucking onions. All that double, triple, quadruple texting. Relax. Ugh. And it beat the dudes you really was trying to give a chance. You're like, wow, you're like not even my type. I was trying to give you a chance. Now I see why I don't give you fucking weird ass motherfuckers chances. 
All right, so anyways, I'm about to use these green chilies in a can. They're just diced jalapenos because um, I just have them and I need to get rid of them. So. What the? All right, bitch. You don't want to come out. Then I gotta do a bunch of garlic. Mm. Y'all are so weird sometimes. If you are a weird ass bitch hating on my goddamn life, can you please just unfollow me? And just stop being a weirdo. Okay, anyways. So that was one can. Oh shit, I forgot to put these peppers in. Dang, I should have put them in first so they sauteed. Whatever. I'm gonna cook this shit for like hella long. You're really supposed to use a green pepper, y'all. I'm gonna put two cans of these Goya because these Goya beans because um honestly I really make some bomb ass black beans like I'm not even about to lie to y'all I never even liked black beans until I started doing this recipe what do not get up there Let me say, can you go one day without calling people weird? You love that word. Yes, um, I, I, I cannot. I cannot go one day. Um, unfortunately, I would like to go one day. But unfortunately, people are weird. <laughs> so I can't. I need to express myself. And it's just like a California thing for real to call somebody weird. It's mostly a LA thing for real, but... Um, yeah, calling somebody weird is very disrespectful, but that's kind of my goal. Like, I'm definitely trying to disrespect you when I call you weird. So, you know, it works out. I'm actually very upset that I do not have this damn Goya. These beans are gonna definitely take different. Also, I'm gonna use some chicken bouillon. Bouillon! However, you say it. Just a little bit. Just because I just feel like it's not gonna have as much flavor without the goya. But it'll be fun. Somebody said, wow, looking fat as fuck. Oh, yeah, that's fine, girl, because I'm trying to look fat as fuck because I'm gaining weight for surgery and I'm about to get another BBL, which is something you can't do because you're fucking poor. Um, you do not have the money to um, suck out your fat whenever you want to like I do. Um, that's why you're shaped like a fucking refrigerator. So, yes, I am looking fat and it is okay.